Hello guys, welcome to a brand new vlog. Sorry if you can hear sound in the background. There's construction going on literally like less than five meters away from my window in my flat, but I don't really care because I'm moving out today. Today I'm moving out into a new flat. I'm so excited. I'm just excited for some nice natural light and some more space and a closet because as you guys know, I've been using this, which honestly I may do with, but it'll be nice to have someone actually put my clothes so I don't have to see them all the time. Um, so I'm moving today. I'm gonna get the keys at two and then move in at four. Here you can normally rent a service called like, man in a van or man with a van. Um, but since I have a man with a van, I didn't have to do that. Um, so I'm gonna wait for him to come get me after he's done work and we are going to move all my stuff. It's also 30 degrees today in London, which is hot as fuck um, and there's no AC anywhere. So I wanna give you guys a little tour of my flat um, just before I leave for the mems more than anything. Okay, so here's my room. This I'm giving to Michael, I believe. Um, I have to take that off still. But yeah, this is it. And I never really did anything because I was only here for two months. Then we have the kitchen, or sorry, the bathroom here. The kitchen, the main area with all of my stuff, which honestly all perfectly fit into the bags that I had available. And this is Michael's room. So Michael and I are not gonna be flatmates for this next move, unfortunately, but I have a new flatmate that I'm very excited about and I'm excited to welcome him from Toronto, another Canadian in London, just is what it is these days. Um, and we have a lot of mutual friends, so it'll be fun when our friends come to visit um, once this pandemic is kind of settled a little bit more, hopefully. Um, but I'll show you guys my new place today, which I'm so stoked about. I'll do an empty, sort of empty apartment tour, um, flat tour, because it is partly furnished, so there'll be some stuff there, but I'll, I'll show you guys what it looks like before I kind of start decorating it a bit. I got the keys. There's four sets, which I mean, there's only two of us, so I guess that means uh, we have some for guests. But I'm walking to flat now. Here we go. We're home. Guys, I'm so happy. Do you see how much natural light there is in here versus the other place already? Like what? <laughs> and I just opened up the fridge to put this away because I brought it over and there's a little welcoming glass of white. How amazing is that? Okay guys, so um, my place is a bit of a shit show still and I don't wanna show you until everything is relatively set up or at least not in the middle of the way. Like, as you can see, I'm drying my new sheets because I didn't have bed sheets and my bed is slightly bigger than in my old flat. Um, so I picked that up today and I've just been organizing stuff all day. Um, but I just got an exciting package I wanna share with you guys. So, I'm gonna show you over here. Okay, um, so I got a package from DHL and we have two little boxes here. So these are Anna Luisa. Um, and I've been waiting for this package. So cute, look at the little sustainable packaging. Um, so I'm doing a little collaboration with them and they sent me some pieces. And what I really love about these pieces is that the way that Anna Luisa produces all their jewelry now is very conscious, which you guys already know I'm a huge fan of because I am trying to make my brand super conscious um, as well um, and as sustainable as possible. So I think there's four pieces here. Okay, so this is the first. It's a cute little paper clip necklace and has a cute little note on it. And have this little bracelet with another cute little <laughs> note on it. And this will look really cute stacked with 
my love bracelet. And then I think we have, oh yes, a couple rings. So we have this one here, which is more of like a statement ring. And then a, another ring, which these look really cute together. Actually, let me put these all on for you. So I picked this necklace here because I really like how it is like a paper clip. I've seen this trending around a lot, um, but the ones that I've seen are a little bit too expensive. So I really like that this one here is affordable. Um, all of their jewelry is actually affordable. It starts at like $39 USD, which is pretty good for like a nice quality you know ring or set of earrings or necklace that isn't going to tarnish it's kind of like that in between of like you know costume jewelry and fine jewelry but this is basically like fine jewelry at an affordable price versus a luxury price which is why i love it like they're all very very simple pieces so i'll leave a link down below for you guys i'm excited for you to check them out i also have a special code which is 10 percent off with the code christina pin of 10 but i'll also leave that down in the description box so yeah very exciting package um so i just changed into my Mykonos shirt. I still don't have any cutlery or anything, so I have to order in tonight. I have cutlery, but I don't have plates or a pan. And I just went grocery shopping, but I can't cook anything other than salad, so it's either salad or I order something. So I'm probably gonna order something. Um, it's actually not even late, but I'm so tired. I have a massive zar hole. I am gonna do for you guys. Um, which will be out right after this video is up. So stay tuned for that as well. How cute is this set? So my friend Tannis, she reworks all these vintage pieces and this is a Nike set as you can see, which is probably like a top, it's a little bit tight, but that's okay. Um, and very, very cute for summer. I know summer's almost over and I haven't worn it yet, but I think I'm going to shoot this tomorrow when I hang out with Amanda. Um, I'm going to go get some lunch and call Allie at the same time. So I'll see you guys after. Good morning, guys. I'm going to the gym. I have to go get a coffee because I'm literally going to fall asleep. And I'm going to show you guys what my workout entails today with my trainer. Let's go. Alrighty, guys. On my way to get a coffee because I'm literally going to die. Wish me luck. grocery store um I'm just washing some clothes so um I went to go pick up some stuff for my kitchen because we literally have no appliances which is not ideal um so I haven't been able to cook anything and I don't think I'm gonna cook tonight either but I did make myself lunch um salad I've been eating salad because I don't need to use any heat to put it together. But um, I bought a few things. I'll do a little video un unbagging for you guys. So I got an oven mitt, very necessary, um, so I can use the oven. I got a baking pan to make banana bread and to make um, the Song of Style raw bars, which are phenomenal. If you guys haven't tried them, you should go and make them right now. Um, I got this pan, saute pan. This is like 12 pounds, which I thought was a really good price. Um, I got a can opener for all my cans of tuna because I eat a lot of that. 
and end. I got this, which is so unnecessary. This was nine pounds. Um, we don't have a microwave or a toaster, but I thought, why not get a sandwich maker? And these are called bikinis in Spain. Um, like literally, you can go and order it. It's called a bikini at any like cafe in Barcelona. And they're so good, like toasted. A toasted sandwich is so much better than a regular sandwich. So I had to get this. So I guess that means I'm gonna be eating sandwiches more frequently. I also got this bowl. I got a bigger version of this as well, which I already used to eat my salad because I like to eat like massive salads. Um, and then I got this pan, which I used to saute some veggies and then this, and I don't have scissors, so I, yeah. Didn't cut this off yet, but I will soon. So yeah, that's my little haul. Um, I'm just trying to finish editing my YouTube video right now and doing some selects for um, a brand that I'm creating some content for. <sighs> and still applying for jobs, guys. I haven't applied for a job in like three days and I'm like really slacking um, and I need to finish a cover letter to send in tomorrow because it's a company that I really am looking forward to hopefully working at. Another one of those. This is just, it's literally a job in itself, applying for a job. And part of me is like, okay, maybe, I don't know. Obviously it takes a long time to find a job. It's not that easy. Um, but part of me is like, I wonder how long I should go and do this before I take it as a sign that maybe I should just be self-employed. Pray for me guys, wish me luck. Okay, so there's this place called Humble and they have like cauliflower crusted pizza and I'm literally so excited. Oh my God, it looks burnt. <laughs> like it looks burnt. Oh my God. I'm still the colors. <laughs> I'm like so excited and it just does not look anything like the photos. This one looks interesting. Were you cutting this one or you cutting that one? I was going to try and fold that underneath, but then it's got that one. It's so thin. Yeah. I don't know how this is cute. It's like a snack. <laughs> it tastes all theme. How's that one? It was like trouble oil. Nice. Mm? Quite light. <laughs> Good thing we got two. <laughs> it has flavor. Mm. Welcome to the flat. I'm gonna give you guys a little, it's like semi-furnished apartment tour. So come on in. We'll start in my room. So this is my room. It came pretty furnished. You can come in. <laughs> um, there's all this shit everywhere, so I will make it nicer for you guys. But it came with this vanity table with the two, um, what are those called? Side tables for the bed, nightstands, I guess you can call them, the bed frame. And then there's this whole area that I have to figure out what to do with, but I feel like there's a lot I could do with it, like maybe put like flowers or like vases with flowers on them. I don't know, we'll see. Then I have closet space, which is amazing because my other flat had literally no closet space at all. You guys know that. So here we have shower and then the vanity area, which is nice. This thing came with it, which is kind of ugly, but like it does the job. Um, and then in this corner, I'm thinking of getting plants and making it like a whole jungle sort of vibe, which would be fun for in here, since I get so much natural light in the morning. Then on one side. Over here we have the kitchen. The kitchen is so nice. Um, I just got in some of these appliances, which I made coordinate with this, because I thought, why not? 
We have our lovely espresso that I'm just obsessed with and gave me this as well, I'm sure. And then he ordered this really fab knife set, which is uh, super intense, but great for hosting dinner parties. Then we have the living area. So a lot can be done to this room, which I'm excited about. And the light guys, I'm literally living for this. So the sofa came with it. Um, we're gonna get some throw pillows. Again, shelving, we could put decorations on, we could put decorations there, there, all of this came with it, and then you see all my equipment, obviously, just hanging around. Um, and the table also came with it, which is like, not bad. Yeah, so we have Damien's room. Again, it came with the desk, came with the bed, which is great. Um, I mean, we could probably switch this down the line. Oh, you have this? I love this. I know. Oh my god, it's so nice. Barreto. Um, Nightstand and then closet, but clearly we don't have enough closet space because we have so many suitcases, we have no idea where to put. And alas, we have the second bathroom, which is in here. A lot of our stuff is in it already, so it's not like totally empty, but you guys get the gist. So I look forward to furnishing the place. There's literally so much stuff I want to buy, but it's like a step-by-step -step process. So you guys will see the journey of that. And then once the place is done, I'll do like an official flat tour because here it's called a flat and not an apartment. Um, and it'll be with like majority of the things that I want. Um, but very excited for the plant corner um in my bathroom because i feel like that's just going to be a vibe to wake up to every morning hope you guys enjoyed thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next one